Creating a Teacher Website Using Weebly by Curtis Gay for the Tattnall County High School Mathematics Department Creating a class website is very easy when using Weebly. Begin by going to education.weebly.com. All that is required is your email address. After creating a sign-in account, please watch a demo or click Set up a class. Here you can create accounts for students to build their own websites. You're in full control of students' accounts and activity. Allow websites to be set up publicly or be password protected. Create student accounts in bulk. No email addresses required. Perfect for students' e-portfolios and class assignments. Create student accounts by clicking on Add a Student. Students will log in using their assigned username and password. You have a choice of making your class public, visible to all, or private, so that only your students can see the posted information, after logging into the classroom. You can create additional accounts, by clicking on the orange button that says, Add a class. This page would also show the URLs for your students' websites if they create one. They can create up to five pages on their sites. OK. Now you are ready to begin building your web page. Click on the orange button that says Create a Site. You will first choose a website theme from 70 available templates. But don't worry. You can always go back and change this later. Now create a class domain option. For the free option, Use a subdomain of Weebly.com. This is what the page editor looks like before you begin editing your page. The panel on the left of the screen allows you to drag various elements, such as text and images, into your page. From there they can be edited and altered. You can see what I mean, by looking at this slide. I dragged the image icon over into my page and then typed in the image URL for the JPEG file I wanted. You can also insert more advanced items into your page as well, such as Word documents, PowerPoint presentations, and embedded videos. When you are finished, make sure to click the Publish button to ensure that your newly created page makes it to the World Wide Web. And here is the finished product. Students can then log in at students.weebly.com with the username that you created. Questions? Please feel free to contact me with any questions, concerns, or problems that may arise. I hope now that you see, just because something is new to us, doesn't mean that it has to be difficult. And remember, make sure that you give your students a reason to keep returning to your website.